Hi, welcome back to Ming Tutorial. Today, we will talk about creating a duplicate or clone in 3 Asma. There are several ways to create the duplicate or clone in 3 Asma, but the most easiest way is using the stroke key Ctrl V. First, create the object. Select object and press Ctrl V on the keyboard. The clone option appears. You can change the name of new creation. Is it clone number one? You can see it appear on the scene explorer, but you can't see it on the viewport because it's in the same position of the original. Now you should move it out to see this. The most efficient way to create the clone is using the transform stone. We have the move, rotation, and scale here. Firstly, we come up with the move button. Select move and click select option. Shift, hold shift and drag the mouse. Follow the X. The clone option appear and it have the little different from the previous because it has in this dialog you can enrich more clone in one time. You can create more clone in one time. I want to create two clones so I type two and okay I have two clones. Clone number one and clone number two. The adding subconscious one offset by the same distance of the previous it. Let's see how is it going with the rotation button. Select rotation button on the clone number two. Hold chip and drag the mouse follow the direction. Now we have the clone form rotation. And then we're coming up with the scale. Select option, object, and hold the scale gizmo, hold shift, and drag the mouse out to create the clone bigger cover outside of the original. Or you can move in to create a clone smaller inside the original. I create the bigger one. Is it clone form scale? That's it how create the clone with rotation and scale. Now we're coming back with the clone option dialog. We want, I want to focus on this part because it's important. Is it where you can define the method of clone you wish to read? There are three methods, copy, instant, and reference. The copy, now we come up with the copy. The copy create the completely separate clone from the original. Modify one had no effect on the other. Now we try to modify the box number two and you see that the original didn't change. The then we will create the instant and see how it look. The instant ray are completely interchangeable clone of the original. Modify an instant object is the same as modifying the original. And then we come with the reference. The first look, the reference look very simple, very look like the instant. And when I modify the parameter of the reference, the original and instant chain follow us. So what different between pre-reference and instant? This is a blue line up here. This make the difference when we add more modify up the blue line. I will add the twist and see the twist only effect on the reference. It don't have an effect on the 
original or the instant. That is how the reference instant and copy works. See you the next episode.